Now, you know, I don't know why I have to say a thing like that, but I think it's important for us to remember, you know, don't write bad code. Programmers get into a trap. They get into this trap of the schedule and the pressure, and they think, I've, I've just got to get this done, and I just don't care about the rules anymore. I've just got to code until I'm done. This will always make you go slower. Even if you do it for an hour, it will make you go slower. There is no way to rush and go fast. In software, those are oxymorons. They're, if you rush, you will go slower. You will make stupid decisions that you will have to correct. And you'll have to correct them within minutes. Right? And you will also make a mess. And the mess will have to be cleaned, but you won't have time to clean it properly, so it will stay a mess. And then you will get caught into this trick, and it happens within days. You get caught into this, into this problem of moving aside the mess you made yesterday so that you can make today's mess. And then moving that mess aside so that you can make the next mess. And all of that moving of mess takes time. And it feels like you're working, but all you're really doing is moving around the mess that you should never have made in the first place. So there is a fundamental law that has to get into our brains and into our hearts somehow. And that fundamental law is something that, you know, our parents had tried to teach us for decades and their parents had tried to teach them for decades. Anything worth doing is worth doing well. There is no way to go fast by making a mess, period. So now that takes courage. You have to stop and think, okay, wait, the pressure is on. I have to go fast. What does it mean? That means I have to do a good job. I have to be deliberate. Imagine that you are having an out-of-body experience. You are on the operating table, having open heart surgery, and you are in the spirit world above the table, looking down on your body, opened up by the doctor. Now, the doctor has a deadline, literally. How do you want this doctor to behave? Do you want him being careful, moving deliberately, competent, carefully moving things around, cutting just right, sewing just right, not moving quickly? Or do you want him to act like the typical programmer? Damn! Oh! 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 You choose. 